Given a starting and ending value describing a range of integers, Sherlock must determine the number of square integers within that range, inclusive of the endpoints. A square integer is an integer which is the square of an integer. Given the range 24 through 49, the square integers are 25, 36, and 49. Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Wow! How do you code that? In this video, we'll examine two methods for solving the Sherlock and Squares Hacker Rank Challenge. The logical approach to solving this problem consists of a nested for loop, that evaluates each integer in the given range, incrementing a counter when the integer is found to be a square integer. While this approach works well for small ranges, this solution doesn't work well, in terms of processing time, for large integers. The mathematical approach to solving this problem, consists of finding the difference of the square roots of the upper and lower boundaries of the given range. For example, if our range is 4 and 16, the square root of 4 is 2, and the square root of 16 is 4. The difference of the upper and lower boundaries is 2. However, if our range is 4 and 17, the square root of 4 is 2, but the square root of 17 is 4.12311. 17 is not a square integer, but if we round down, we get 4. This calculation leaves out the first number in the sequence, so we have to add 1 to get the true length. The programmatic solution to the Sherlock and squares problem, takes the difference of the square root of b, and the smallest value that is greater than or equal to the square root of a, adds a value of 1, and returns the result to the caller. Thank you for watching, and we look forward to seeing you in the next episode of Wow! How do you code that?